Today, we're finishing the hockey rink. Gotta put up more light posts, put up the rest of the boards, we're good. It'll only take about an hour, and I'll flick the lights on tonight and show you what it looks like. It's gonna be beautiful. Lights. There we go. Oh, that is bright. So we had one day where we could actually skate. Then we had some crazy weather. And here we are again, starting at fresh. Woo! I should have put these lights on in like October, November. <laughs> but uh, the job will get done. Also been meaning to add something here to put all the hockey sticks and snow shovels, so that, that'll happen. Let's actually check the ice. Well, this is looking decent. We might be able to skate on this like tomorrow. Okay. Uh, nah. I mean, there's ice forming, so that's good. We gotta get some skis on this little wagon. Cooked a nice meal in this uh, stove the other day. Ooh. That looks and smells delicious. Actually tastes really, really good. Nice and smoky. All right, by now, this stuff. This is the netting. Meshing that goes around. Oh, oh, that's what these are for. <laughs> Probably should have put those on a little while ago. These things hold the netting up. They're supposed to go over each of those uh, support posts there. I should get a fire going. Can't build a rink with a little fire. You know what? I think I'll test the uh, big fire pit today. Uh, same as the stove in the last video, except for like uh, five times the size. Got some recycling. <laughs> Probably grab a couple logs. Got me. Looks like I need a new chopping log. That ought to do the trick. Nice and light. I did not follow these instructions last time. Oh yeah. Nice, yeah, yeah, got the. Wow. Keep a few to the side. The Lincoln Logs. I think that's what you're supposed to call it. Two hours later. The board really doesn't like starting on fire. This would actually be better. I got a bit of a fire going on there. Cheat a little here. Let's get this build going. I need these pieces. You can grab these pool noodles though. Let's see the instructions. Clips. All right, liner clips. I think you just go like this. Pull the liner up and put the clip on. <laughs> Those are to put the, uh, the netting up a little later on. So we have to move this bracket out of the way. That's what I'm saying. I hope they're not frozen in. Not gonna move? Well, that's the thing. that's why it makes it a little bit more difficult. That strap runs underneath the ice surface and connects to that side. That's what keeps the boards from like exploding out. This is how we announce the game. Ladies and gentlemen, let the games begin. And continue. Nice. That's gonna be so nice here. Have the pucks and they can rim around. Nice. And now, we need one flat board. Where, oh, where could that be? Ah, the last board. Da, da, da. Ooh, that's gonna be fun. Excuse me, pyrotechnic friends. Okay, now we gotta put the netting up. Time to put up the netting. We got the red caps and all of these. They're gonna slide into this little slot and the red caps just keep them from poking through the other side. So uh, once we take the rink down, can I store all this in your garage? <laughs> Reading, good. Neither of us have read the instructions, right? They were very vague. It's, it's a one pager. I told you, it's like take out a box, put together. <laughs> have fun. Yeah, you know this piece, yeah, yeah. 
Come on. This ain't no joke of a hockey ring, that's for sure. Next year, help me build a roof over top? Yeah. <laughs> Whew. Oh, nice. Hey, might as well get the lights up. I don't think this is really in there. I think it's just held in place. A nice kick. Got her. Oh, a hockey stick too. Bonus find. Definitely need a rack. Some hockey tape here. Here's the wire. Let's see where we want to put this one. And how. Alright, let's see what we got in the pocket. Uh, I got hockey tape, cell phone, got clips. Uh, oh, wrench with a uh, yeah 916 socket. Wow. I moved it in. It used to be right in the corner. It used to be right here. And I was like, if it's there, it'll hit the netting and put like weird shadows. So I tried to put it more in the middle so it would flood the rink. It's not snowing now. Got lots of clear hockey tape left. If I fall, will you catch me? Nope. This reminds me of the last thing my grandpa said to me. Stop shaking the ladder, I'm gonna fall. I know I said that I was gonna have the lights on by the end of this video, but I also thought it would only take an hour. It took a lot longer. We needed more supplies. I got some twinkle lights for the A-frame, some more rubber mats. I loaded it all up on the sled, and I just sent Mason down the hill. Don't send me down! So stay tuned to our next video, where we also find out if cooking spray helps keep the snow off of your shovel. Hit that subscribe button, and we'll see you in the next video. <laughs> Olivia, watch out!